And then if you take, uh, take a look over here, you're going to see many special books. Their sizes are very different, and they're very colorful. That's right. These are picture books. picture books? Because picture books are wonderful, authentic materials for you to enjoy reading. And uh, here at Language Center, um, many, we have many great teachers who, are, um, who knows a lot about um, children's literature. Uh, uh, they know a lot, and that's why we have a really nice collection uh, of uh, picture books. A lot of great um, authors for picture books uh, are here. You can find their books here. For example, this one, Dr. Seuss. Dr. Seuss, Cat in the Hat. Cat in the Hat, 非常有名的这个读本啊，它最有名的地方就是它的这个押韵, Cat in the Hat, right? Uh, cat in the Hat. So there are rhymes there, and when you read the book, it's not only very interesting, but also help you to uh, improve your pronunciation and get an idea and have the fun of r rhyming. Okay, and also like uh, we have some classic. Uh, children's literature also, like this one, Make Way for Ducklings. Uh, Make Way for Ducklings. Uh, it's not colored, but it's very famous and it's really great. Okay? And also, uh, another very famous uh, writer for picture books is Anthony Brown. Anthony Brown, uh, Anthony Brown, uh, introducing Anthony Brown. This one is Piggy Book. Piggy Book about a mother who takes care of everything in the house, and one day she decides to quit, okay? And then she leaves the house, and so they have to take care of themselves by uh, they have to take care of themselves. Okay, uh, so this one, picky book. And this author is also very, very famous, Eric Cowell. Eric Cowell, okay? His books are very interesting and beautifully illustrated. Okay, like this one, very famous one, Brown Bear, Brown Bear, what do you see? Um, even if we're college students, if you read a book like this, you, you can enjoy this kind of rhyming thing, okay, and very interesting intonation when you read the story. Um, and also, Reading Corner uh, has a very special activity called Storyteller uh, Activity. Language Center will give you training and teach you how to use your voice more, pro more properly, how to use uh, vocal variety, and then you'll be sent to kindergartens in the neighborhood and tell stories to little kids. It's a very interesting activity. If you find it, um, if you're interested, you can uh, pay attention to the news. And also, like this one, Leo Le Leone, very famous author also, 也是得奖的, inch by inch, about this inch worm. 这个尺货, inch by inch. Leo Leone. A lot of great uh, picture story, picture books here. Okay? So you can also take a look, and they can be um, some of your starters also. Okay? And then if we come over here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Wow. You can see a lot of interesting books about uh, culture, different cultures and different countries in the world. Um, for example, like this one, 100 Great Cities of the World. Okay, so it has many pictures, a lot of interesting pictures. It introduced 100 Great Cities in the World. Very interesting one. You can see that there are many words there, but when you read this kind of story, you don't have to read for details. You can simply pick the cities that you like. So you pick the cities that you're interested in, that one day you want to be able to go, you, want, you hope that you can travel there, and then you can read the story, read the cities. 
，嗯，像我现在大英文班上有一个学生，他就是选这本书做他这学期的 extensive reading。啊、uh, ，at first he he liked this story, but he was kind of worried that he wouldn't be able to finish this big book. And I told him that since this book is really big, you only need to finish one third of the book. That means it's around 30 cities. But later on, he found it so interesting. He said that he couldn't stop, and he wanted to finish all the cities. Okay, he had already finished like uh, uh, 60 cities. Okay,、uh, so you see,、uh, reading has this kind of charm to keep you going there. And also,、um, there's a series called、um, One Thousand Places to See Before You Die. 有有一系列的书都是什么什么 before you die. Okay, for example. One thousand places to see before you die, and later we're going to see like one、uh, thousand albums to to hear before you die. Ah, so this one, 当然不是翻成说你死之前一定要去的一千个地方，应该是说你这辈子一定要去拜访的哈。一千个 places, of course, one thousand is really a lot, right? So you, you can also pick the ones that you like, and many interesting information there. If you like traveling, you're going to like the stories like this, okay? And then many other、uh, great stories here. I'm going to leave it to you, okay? I just want to give you an idea. A lot of time, you might find that reading、um, can be very difficult. That's because you always read textbooks, okay? If you come and read for pleasure, you're going to find there's so many choices, so many varieties, and you can read them for entertainment.